The White Weirdo Part 2. Bucky Barnes, born in Shelville, India. Bucky Barnes was a soldier in the U.S. Army during World War II. Bucky Barnes fought alongside Captain America, a.k.a. Steve Rogers, and the Howling Commandos. Captain America and Bucky fought Hydra many times in the war. With the help of Captain America and Bucky Barnes, Hydra began losing its grip on the world. Captain America and Bucky Barnes saved many lives. It was until Captain America and Bucky Barnes fought the Red Skull hey, for one last time. Come watch they the were tape of the Winter and Soldier to be with discovered. us. And so they fought. Bucky Barnes was soon found by the Red Skull around the Arctic Ocean. Red Skull took Bucky Barnes and began to experiment on him. Bucky Barnes was given a metal arm to replace his missing left arm. Bucky Barnes went through many experiments of brainwashing. During this time, Red Skull had snuck his way into S.H.I.E.L.D. as Alexander Lukin. Red Skull was using S.H.I.E.L.D. to strengthen Hydra. Red Skull played S.H.I.E.L.D. right under the noses. However, some found out the truth. Okay, Before Red Skull's more identity was revealed to everyone, Red Skull used Bucky Barnes, now known as the Winter Soldier, to silence them. None of this adds up. Alexander oh, was I think I saw the start. Is this the part where Red Skull battles Bucky and Captain America in the White House? Or was that an Independence Day? Or was it transformed and fell and returned to Earth? Chaos. Alexander is always screwed up like this, but he always gets away with it. If you look back at past records, every time he screwed up and lost something, someone among us would be assassinated. My guess is they figured out what Lucan was doing, and before they could tell anyone, he'd kill them. What you're saying seems true, but there's not much evidence. However, there's evidence of Alexander losing the weapons and assaults. He really could have naturally lost them, but what doesn't make sense is that he should have been deranked because of it. 